If you're looking for a compact, affordable, lightweight travel tripod, the Zomei Z669 is just right for you. This is a tripod for beginners that you can use both outdoors and indoors. It has a great build, nice design, and guess what? You can use it inverted for low-level photography or videography, and you can also use it as a monopod. All this for less than $120 today on Amazon. It used to sell for $140, but you can get it on discounts when you click on the link in the description below. I have been using this tripod for over a year, and this is my honest review of the Zomei Z669 coming up next. Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Damn. Hi guys, welcome to another edition of Cyber Reviews. When considering a travel tripod, you need to look at factors such as build materials, height, folding size, weight, steadiness, and ease of use, especially if you are a beginner. I use my tripods to shoot my tech videos, so I need a tripod that can shoot sit down videos and also do really nice B roll footage. This is especially important to me because the camera I use for filming, the Sony A5100, does not have image stabilization inbuilt. So, because I want smooth footage for my B-rolls, I decided to get a tripod. Before buying the Zomei Z669 tripod, however, I did not know better. I bought a very big and heavy tripod which did not even have a ball head or a fluid head. Carrying it around was difficult and it could not meet the demands or the purpose for which I bought it complete waste of money. So after doing my research and reading a lot of reviews, I decided to purchase the Zomei Z669. I have never regretted it. I do not think I have any piece of equipment that I like more when it comes to creating videos. Here's why. When it comes to the build materials, if you are looking to purchase a tripod, aluminum and carbon fiber are the most common materials for travel tripods. Carbon fiber is stronger, lighter and resists rust in wet conditions, but it's more expensive too. The Zomei Z669 is made of carbon fiber, and one thing which really impressed me about the build quality is that it is dust resistant. It also has this gold and black design which is really beautiful to look at. This tripod feels very premium when you hold it. The build quality is excellent. The next important thing to consider is height. Not only how high does the tripod extend, but the minimum height as well. Some can get as low as 3 inches from the ground, while others can extend up to 6 feet high. Smaller tripods weigh less, but they can also limit your framing options. The reason why I chose the Zomei Z669 tripod though is because it has a neat trick up its sleeve where you can invert it and that allows you to get really close to the ground for macro shots. At full length, this tripod can extend to 152 cm which is more than enough for me. The next thing to consider is how small does it fold? Can you easily fold it and put it in your bag? Does it come with a case? The answer to both questions in the case of the Zomei Z669 is yes. When it comes to weight, if a tripod is too heavy, you won't want to lug it around all day through a city or like when you are hiking or wherever. Lightweight tripods are usually more expensive. The key is to find a balance. The Zomei Z669 tripod weighs only 1.45 kilograms or around 3 pounds, making it a good fit for carrying around. A tripod must also be steady, especially if you intend to use it like in outdoor terrains where the surface is uneven. This tripod has pegs at the end of the rubber feet for grassy or mountainous areas, ensuring that the tripod is steady both indoors and outdoors. Now to the final thing to look out for, which to me is even more important or most important, is the ease of use. I started making tech videos barely a year ago. Before then, I was completely naive on how to use a camera or tripods. So if you watch my earlier videos, you'll notice that the footage was very very shaky or at all manner of weird angles. I do a lot of b-rolls in my videos like what you are watching currently and I like to add text and other graphic elements to emphasize what I'm talking about in the videos. So I needed a tripod that could just set up and start using easily. This tripod was 
all that and more. I have never used it as a monopod, but you can detach the legs and use one of the legs as a monopod. What else could you ask for? So let me know in the comments which tripod you use or any tripod alternatives to the Zomei Z669 that you can suggest. And if you like this video, please click on the like button and share to any filmmaker who is looking to purchase a tripod. Now, if you're new to my channel, I do mobile phone reviews, mobile app reviews, and I bring to you affordable gadget reviews to help you make an informed decision whenever you're making a purchase. So if you like that kind of content, please click on the subscribe button, turn on all notifications so you do not miss any episode. Thanks, Bibri.